Yo, what's going on everybody? It's Decker Game here and welcome back to another video on my channel today. I'm gonna show you guys how I edit my videos. Part two this time is an actual live tutorial and how I do it. Basically it's a tutorial on how to use photo P and Photoshop Touch. So first off I'm gonna start off with photo P how I do some of my um, things so you can choose any file you want if it has a PSD file or any of one of these files they show in the first screen you can pick any one's PSD, PNG, JPEG, whatever file you have um, you can edit it here so I'm just gonna open up this ML cache right here from GTA 5 some takes a while to load some take a while to load depending on the file size so I already have kind of magic in this in my path so hide it and sometimes it gets laggy so I'm pretty sure that's only on my computer so well sometimes it gets laggy because of the file size that has like some me megabytes in it it tends to lag so and it's probably because I'm recording. Sorry about that little uh, overwritten top right up there. So, you could choose anything. If there's like items you could hide or use, you could just open up the file, you press the little eye icon, and it shows up. So, you could choose anything, what's in the pack or whatever. So, for example, I'm just gonna click on this pogo right here, for him as a thumbnail. We're gonna use this for an upcoming video that I still have to make. So we're just gonna put him up there. Looks nice, I like it. Just cool. So put that and I'm gonna show you guys how to change the text right now. You open up the text file and you press this text icon here. And there we go. If you're done, just click that little check icon. Also to know if you just want to like edit in your own text, you can just open up another thing, just open like that and hide the text that's already there. You have to click on the text you want to edit. Uh, keep in note that this does not um, have a lot of um, what you call it, fonts and so it will just change from that big thing to this. Mm, it's okay, I don't really care. You can change the text however you want. I'm just gonna edit it right now. Show you guys what I can do. So, in this pack, there's like a ton of backgrounds you can change. I'm gonna change my background. You can do it. I just put this on the inside of the text. It's a tiny bit. So you want to play it for this one at a time. He's kind of lagging right now because of the fire size and all that. Um, and yeah, that looks kind of nice. I like it that it looks nice. Um, you could do this with any PSD pack or template, just look them up and get them. Now, if you want to save it, you could save for the web if you want it to save on your thing, or save for PSD if you want to go on. It. A dope Photoshop with it, but right now I'm gonna save for the web, and you can change any image format you want. So JPEG, paint, you know, all that. I'm gonna go with ping right now, and then press save and save here. Now I'm gonna transfer it over. So I just transferred it over to my thing. Um, that's my video editor right there, and this is where you can edit your fonts, whatever. Right now we're gonna go on Photoshop Touch. I will do a video editing tutorial later for one of these days. Um, I will I will put the link to the website so it can how to uh, download Photoshop Touch as it's off from play for it and all that. So I'm gonna need to do a bit of these. So this is mostly the pack I use to edit like uh, photos, like the borders and all that. Add some special effects on all that. Oh, it's heavy to see, I guess. Oh, nice effects. I don't really know what these two things do. What their purpose is. Some light up 
nice. This is nice. I might be used it for this uh, border thing. I like it. So what I do is I click down here and out comes all this on my downloads and all that. Click my thumbnail that I just got, transferred it over, and I put it up to the edge. So it matches up. Press check on that. And now I press the border, see if it looks nice. I know it kinda already has a border, but this one looks nicer. I like it. Yeah, let's put that. Yeah, that looks nice on it. it looks pretty good for it. So yeah, I'm gonna leave it with the red thing. That looks pretty good. Else, nope. And I would see if I could uh, save. Well, put this little pack in the description. I also can get some other things. Uh, I don't really want them. So, that's yeah, so. The way for this save is to this low. Uh, this thing supports PSDX pack. As I first set again, so. Yeah your own packs for this so that you can save these and jpegs or things so basically that's all for this video hope you all have enjoyed if you have enjoyed leave a like comment and subscribe and i'll see you all next time peace out guys Motherfucker!